What's up everybody, Ride with Will, and you know what, I decided to take my KLX250 on the pass of Mount Entero, which is located in Colorado, right by Mount Princeton. I have to tell you, this place is probably one of the steep steepest passes that we have. Not the steepest, but one of the steepest, and to make this story short, uh, I was not able to get to the summit due to the power of the KLX250. Yep. That's the problem with the KLX. Really? Yeah, even with the fan on, it was like overheating pretty bad. Yeah, I didn't want to stop there. That's like no power. Really? Yeah. No, just be careful. I'll be fine. No. I don't think it has enough power. Because I can. <laughs> and like somebody to Nope. Nope. <sighs> so, I know what you guys might say. Why not clutch or go at it at full revs? Well, that is the thing. I was giving it full throttle. And the minute I started clutching, I obviously lose a little speed and a little bit of power. And then as I engage the clutch, the power was just not there to pick it back up it wasn't there to pick that momentum back up it would just start lugging till the point of the bike would barely want to go here worried about i don't know if it was as steep as the other ones it's pretty steep from here yeah it does look i mean i remember going down it and it was that looks pretty steep Barely no power. <laughs> really? Are you full throttle? Yeah. Uh oh. No, yeah, you're still going. You're still going. Come on, Will. You can do it. There you go. Guys, I've done many passes and steep trails with the KLX 250, but although it does not look like it on camera, it is a long, steady, steep grade. It's not difficult besides the large loose rocks, just steep is all, and it's just a constant, non stop climb. So, we are in this is Mount Ontario up here, right? Yeah. Yep. Man, it's just crazy how, like, how steep deep it gets right there on the top oh wow this thing is so rutted out now what <laughs> heavy equipment heavy equipment this is heavy equipment <laughs> shit that would be pretty radical trying to drag a bulldozer up here oh geez Woo! We got water crawl. Oh man, I just got all wet. Now, Mount Entero is not necessarily new rider friendly, and I don't think many beginner riders would even do this pass. Although it does look flat on camera, it has some intense grade and loose, let's say, adult heads instead of baby heads. Other than that, the uh, like any old dirt bike, the KLX 250 handled great. It did tackle the pass just fine, uh, besides the power. That obviously is the only complaint I have. But then again, these are not beginner trails, beginner friendly trails, I'm sorry. Now, onto the scenery. Now, Mount Entero has to be one of my favorite rides, obviously due to the beautiful scenery. It is definitely breathtaking and, well, see for yourself. <laughs> 